Hey guys. Okay, I got started by doing the day one campaign and the pickpocket. Um, the first, there's two. So I've done everything I can do without actually activating him to this point. So I'm looking at the exchanges. Hopefully I'll get lucky. No. Okay. I like to do them in smaller sets. Still no. Okay, well, let's see what we can collect. Different pieces. Okay, one more exchange and I'll get 25. Where else can I grab pieces? Oh, okay. Then that's all I need. Just a quick collect. I'm going to go back over here. Part two and collect some of these. I just need to do one more exchange. And then I activate him no matter what, even if I didn't get lucky. Still nothing. But doing the 10, you get him. So, Well, that's assuming you've done the two campaigns and the daily. Just collect a bit. Okay. There we go. And I'll pause the video through um, tune up so you guys don't have to sit through it since I already did a video of that. Just level them up. So, don't forget to collect the carrots. Um, they are in the event exchange. As with all these bugs tunes, I can't be the only one who's low on them. So you can collect, and this is on any tune, by pressing on them like that and buying the five a day. And then while he's in the store, these are in the store for the event exchange. You could do them that way. But if you're low on carrots like I am, you're going to need to do that every day or you will not be able to get all those tune-ups in. What else we can collect? Oh, pieces. Okay, we're gonna head over to Cannonball here, part one. Let me find, let me find somebody I can skip their turn so we can just see his actual animation. Let's start. Yeah, I think they're still gonna kill. I'm gonna put it on some weaker tunes. So it's Rocky and Muggsy. Mm, oh, you know what? The baby, I can skip his turn, so I'll keep him. Since I don't actually use them, I have to look and see what their attacks are, it's been so long. I don't actually remember. Okay, that works. Hi. 
I love when tunes stun. I find it so useful. My gangsters have great actual animations. I just hopefully I'll get to rank them up and bring them up to my level that I can actually use them. Do one more since I didn't get in his last battle there. Oops. And after that, I do have to go back and spin the wheel because I usually do that to start an event and. For some reason, I don't know why I haven't done that. I didn't even actually check out the cool ticket wheel yet. Hopefully it actually has tins on it that I need still. finish off my snow bandits in this event as well so I have them pretty tuned up let me know in the comments who you're actually working on this event okay so I think I'll just come back to this in a little bit here. Let's see this ball and chain wheel. Okay, how do I get more? Hmm. I want to try and refrain from spinning that until I have enough that I get that extra spin. Featured two pieces, I'll get like three more. That's still not enough. But I'll spin the gold ticket wheel. Mm -hmm. Of course a jackpot that I don't need. <laughs> of course. For once I'd actually rather get some of the people on the wheel and I get a jackpot. But when I want a jackpot, I can't get one. Let's spin again. Okay, Rocky. Marcy. I need them. Mm. Nothing I actually need. That's a lot of hammer stuff. Getting closer. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to resist spinning that ball and chain wheel until I get enough of them. 
Let's see. Do I get him? Spencer. I already have him maxed. Well, that's all for now. Bye. Good luck.